So I was watching Gary with the T a a few minutes ago and Gary done sat here and said that Tiffany Haddish um, was interviewed on the Ellen show and Ellen had said, is there any, Ellen had asked her, Ellen DeGeneres had asked her, well, is there anybody you have been with or slept with that no one knows about? I don't even know why Ellen would ask that. I just feel like that's so, so over-sexual for that show. Like, what's the point? I don't get that. But anyway... Of course, they already know about these questions. They already know what's going to happen. She going to say, with Chingy, the rapper Chingy. Okay. Now, Tiffany, now I'm going to be your big sister for a minute. I'm going to be your big sister for a minute. You just got a show that Steve Harvey just lost. And that kid said the darndest things, right? Or kids say the funniest things. Kids say the darndest things. Kids say the funniest. I think it's kids say the darndest things. Now, that's a very family-oriented, straight-walking, publicly acceptable show. You can't do kids say the darndest things and then be on these interviews talking nasty. Now, that may not seem fair, but once again, they got you, you know, uh, uh, dressed down, very conservative on kids say the darnest things. Now, um, my personal opinion right now, Tiffany, is that you are not quite comfortable on this show. I mean, because it is a new show. I can see in your eyes, this is my opinion, I can see in your eyes, you like, I don't know how long I'm able to do this. Cause that's a big pay money, big, big money, big money paying gig, big. They trying you out, but see, you need to stop. You need to pull back. Cause I think you did say on one of your shows, you are going to pull back or one of your interviews. You need to hush. Now you almost got, now you girl, you, that's, that's, that, that's a Caucasian show. Let's be real. That's a Caucasian owned show. They don't let your little brown behind get on there to be the host or the hostess. And now you're doing interviews talking about who you had sex with, if it wasn't good, what hotel you was in. And now you're trying to be, now you got a contract with the network that carries kids say the darnest things. Girl! Be careful. Just be careful because you have to remember the, the, the movies that black folks or people of color play in and the characters that black folks play versus others, that sticks. We're taken very literally. And with our literal, literalliness, <laughs> that's not even a word, um, we got to, in that entertainment game, and even in the corporate world, even in a you know, regular office world, you got to play chess. I've been the pawn. I've been the pawn. I know that feeling. And I just want to say, Tiffany, you got a long road ahead of you. You can do this, but back up off them interviews talking too much about your sexual prowess and that's not gonna go. Cause that's not the rope you 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 are, you know, bring it down. Cause I already see where this is going. Maybe somebody got something in for you. I don't know. But these little sexual questions and stuff, you got to be more demure, a little more secretive, and make it into a joke. And don't give all this information to these folk when you got a whole million dollar, I'm just thinking, uh, a contract with somebody that has to do with cheering and families. That's just my opinion. I am not an expert. It's just my opinion. Sister to sister. Okay, peace. Bye.